Hi everyone, it's Edie here from Virtually In Sync and I'm coming in with a tutorial on using a new feature in Canva for work called Canva Animator. And the way that this works is that it works with your existing designs that you've created and it only works however if you do not have any filters on it and if you have not uploaded any custom fonts. It will only work with a normal filter and if it's the embedded fonts that are already within Canva. But it's really super simple and so I just wanted to quickly show you. This is an image that does not have a filter on it and the font is already uh, located within Canva's library of fonts. And all you need to do is just go to download like you typically would when you were finished with one of your designs. And when you go to file type, you're going to now see that there is an animated GIF movie that is available. This is um, what they're considering in beta or I guess experimental phase. And so once you click on that, it just tells you that you can try out this experimental feature if you would like to turn your design into an amazing animated content. And so then you click on preview animation and then it gives you six different animation styles. So the first is rise. So you see that the text is rising. The next is bounce. The third is slide. I really like slide. <clears throat> next we have block. Next is 3D. And then the last is fade. So I'm going to select slide. And then you can download as a movie or download as a GIF. And I'm going to download this as a GIF. And now it's going to start to export your animation. Um, this shouldn't take that long because it's just one image. However, if you had multiple pages of designs within your um, file that you were working, then it would take a little bit longer. But this should be finished fairly quickly. Great. Okay, and so I'm just going to save this as animation number two. And then when we play it, it plays as a gift. So there you go. Now the difference, just so that you know um, quickly, the difference between a movie and a GIF. A GIF, if you want to embed that, say for example, in your email, it's going to be able to play within your email versus a movie because a movie has to be linked to like YouTube or Vimeo or something like that when you're using it for your email. Whereas a GIF is in essence interpreted as a, a image file. So that's the difference. Um, if that made sense, hopefully it did. Anyway, I would love to hear what your thoughts are. This is only available if you have Canva for work. It is not available on the free version of Canva. Okay, so enjoy, take care. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like it, share it with your friends and colleagues, and do leave a comment below. Thanks again.